Coming from teaching second graders, I didn't really see myself as a scientist, but that changed when I fell in love with astronomy. Hi, my name is Rosario Cecilia Flores Ali. I am from the Bronx in New York City. I'm about to graduate from a master's of science in astrophysics. As a girl, I've never thought myself as a scientist. I think a huge factor was that I didn't see anyone that looked like me or came from similar upbringings as me. Receiving this degree means so much to me. First, knowing that I can achieve great things is a reminder that it doesn't matter where you start. It just matters that you keep pushing. As a first generation daughter from immigrant parents, it's not only a big accomplishment for myself, but for my family and my community. The reason that I decided to apply for the master's program in astrophysics here at CUNY was I was craving more of astronomy and astrophysics coursework. Another reason is because I felt like I needed more research experience under my belt before committing to a full PhD program. So my next step is I'll be starting my PhD in geological sciences at Cornell University. I'll be looking at geysers here on Earth and draw connections to geysers that we see on active moons orbiting gas giants like Jupiter and Saturn. Studying these geologically active moons can help us correlate with habitable worlds outside of our solar system orbiting other stars. The way this program helped me prepare for my next step is by helping me build the coding skills I needed Prior to starting the program, I had zero programming skills, so learning from scratch how to even interpret the language was very helpful. My mentor, Jackie Faraday, and the rest of the research team, BDNYC, was really supportive and helpful in providing that scaffolding that I needed at the beginning to get comfortable with coding, which helped with my research. My ultimate goal is to end up working at NASA doing mission work, especially around one of my favorite moons, Enceladus. My advice for future astrophysics students, I would say be yourself. Don't be afraid to not know much. That's why the program is here for, to help you grow and start from where you're at. And don't be afraid to ask questions, especially if you feel lost or if you need support in any way, academically or emotionally or mentally or whatever you're going through, just know that you have a good tight-knit community in the CUNY Astro program.